who is Meghan Markle's former bodyguard. Female staff member has quit Meghan Markle's bodyguard has stepped down from her position according to news. Meghan's female staff member made headlines during the Sussex's trip to Australia. Meghan Markle's female bodyguard has stepped down, according to a Scotland Yard source. The security staff member escorted Meghan and Prince Harry during their tour of Australia, Tonga and Fiji. Why has the bodyguard left her role with the 37-year-old Duchess? This is the third member of staff to leave Meghan's employ since she became the Duchess of Sussex. The woman, who was employed as Meghan's chief protection officer has already vacated her job, according to a Scotland Yard source speaking to the Sunday Times. She has never been named, but the blonde woman was pictured with Meghan in December. The source said, unlike someone who has grown up in the royal family and has been used to close protection from an early age, having it can be quite constraining. Even though she was a famous actress, she could still do what she wanted in the way of getting around freely. But in her current role she can't go anywhere without her protection team and it's a massive constraining force on an individual like her. The two other staff members to quit are her private secretary Samantha Cohen, 49, in November. Then her personal assistant Melissa to Abke revealed she was leaving after only six months in her job. Meghan Markle and Prince William have caused rift concerns after Christmas Day. The Duke of Cambridge was thought to have ignored the Duchess when she tried to speak to him. However, an expert has claimed this may not actually be the case. Meghan Markle is pregnant with her first child currently. According to the latest odds Meghan Markle's due date could be as early as February. According to the bookies, Recent glimpses of the Duchess of Sussex's baby bump has left the leading online bookmaker and stalling next month as the favorite in their betting on the due date. The shortest month of the year heads the betting from March at 9-4, with April a 5-2 chance. What is more, the leading online bookmaker has also priced up the individual day of the birth, with Valentine's Day available at 25-1. What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to get instant news update.